Come with me, teach your part one now. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Shan's Patwa Academy, Jamaican Patwa Simplified. In today's lesson, we'll talk about the Jamaican Patwa alphabet or the Cassidy JLU system. Did you know that there's an actual alphabet that has its own rules, that has its own pronunciations? Now, this system is very interesting because many Jamaicans have difficulties actually reading this system. But for consistency purposes, I will be using this system in the videos on this channel. So I thought I would just get it out of the way from the beginning to teach you how to pronounce the letters and to get some form of consistency with this issue. Let's get right into it. The Jamaican Patwa alphabet and writing system otherwise known as the Cassidy JLU system. This system has a few characteristics. The first of which is that it is not yet standardized or regulated. Because of this, there are many variations to the spellings of words. For example, Wagwan can be spelled in so many different ways. And all of these ways are acceptable because there is no one body that has regulated the writing system to say that this is wrong or this is right. So many people still use English spellings with Patwa pronunciations, but this system provides a more standardized, a more consistent way of writing. And so it allows for consistency, especially for learners of the language who are not from Jamaica or not from English speaking um, countries. Now, the writing system is called the Cassidy JLU system. It is not widely known or widely used, but recently quite a few publications have been written using the JLU Cassidy system. One special mention being the Jamaican New Testament, um, which is quite interesting. I, I really love that um, version of the Bible. Now, this system was developed by Frederick Cassidy in 1961. It was later modified by the Jamaica Language Unit, hence the name, the Cassidy from Frederick Cassidy plus the JLU, Jamaica Language Unit System. So that's how the name has come along. Now this system is, it has a few features. It's broken down into single or short vowels long vowels, double vowels, consonants, double consonants, and it is important to note that each letter only has one sound. The vowels are divided into three different types. We have single or short vowels, long vowels, and double vowels. And once again, remember that each only represents one specific sound. It's not like English where you can pronounce C as the letter C as S and K. In Pato, in this system, in the Cassidy JLU system, each letter only has one sound. And as a matter of fact, C is a letter that's missing from this system. But let's continue. So these are the single vowels or the short vowels. This, this system uses the same vowels as the English alphabet, A-E-I-O-U vowels. However, the pronunciations are a little bit different. And like I said, each letter only ha carries one sound. So A is similar to the A ah sound found in bat. So let's practice. So we have A ah, like Aki. E is similar to the E sound in bed. For example, E in egg. The I is similar to the E sound in it. Iguana. 
iguana. The O is similar to the O sound in love. For example, okra. And the U is similar to the U sound in cook. For example, uman. Long vowels. We have three different long vowels. The double A, double I, and double U. The double A is similar to the long A sound in bass. Ah. Ball. The double I sound is similar to the E sound in teeth. T. And the W is similar to the O sound in boot. Example, shoes. Now, the third section, the third category, is the double vowels. And we have these four double vowel sounds. We have the A, I, I, E, O, U, and the U, O. Now, the A, I is similar to the I sound in bite. So, it's like lime, lime, A, I, lime, lime. The I, E similar to the E sound in nail, nail. Let's practice. Kick. The OU is similar to the O sound in cow. For example, cow, cow. And the UO sound is similar to the O sound in throat. For example, boat, boat. Now, Let's move on to the consonants. Now, this section is broken down into two different sections. And if you don't remember what a consonant is, if it's not a vowel, the, the alphabet has 26 letters. Five of those are vowels, A, E, I, O, U. All the other letters are consonants. Now, the JLU system is also broken down into vowels and consonants, and the consonants are further broken down into consonants and double consonants. And once again, all letters carry only one sound. So let's get into the consonants. B as in bag, same as in English. D as in dog. F as in fat. G as in goat, H as in hat, J as in jam, K as in kick, L as in lamp, M as in monkey, N as in night, P as in pat, R as in ran, S as in save, T as in tag, V as in van, W as in wet, Y as in yam, Z as in zipper. Now, if you noticed while going through the alphabet, there were some missing letters. Now, C is one of those missing letters. C doesn't exist in the Cassidy JLU system. And this is because, like I said before, each letter carries one sound. Now, the two sounds that C makes are S sound, the soft C, and the hard C sound, which is the K. Now, the S sound is already taken care of with the S. So we don't need another replica. We don't need another sound that goes S because the S takes care of that. And the hard C sound, the K, is already taken care of with the K. So there is no need for the C in this alphabet. Another missing letter is the Q. Now the sound that the Q would make, the K sound, is taken care of in the alphabet with the use of KW. So we don't have a Q sound. It, I guess it would be confusing with the Q and the K kind of making similar sounds. So it's already taken care of with K and W, KW. And uh, the final missing letter is the X. And once again, the X sound that the X makes 
is already taken care of by using K with S, the KS consonant blend. So we don't use the C, the Q, and the X. These are missing from the alphabet. So let's move on to double consonants. The first one we come across is CH, and this is pronounced as the CH in chat. Next, we have the NG, as in sing. We have the HN, pronounced as in can, can. And we have the ZH consonant blends, and it's pronounced similar to the SI sound, the J sound in version, version. Now, here are some special mentions, and these are the DN, PN, and the TN. The DN, as in pardon, the PN, as in something, and the TN, as in nothing. So, these are consonant blends, special mentions that you wouldn't normally see in the English alphabet, but they are very common in the Cassidy JLU Patois, Jamaican Patois alphabet. The THR blend in English becomes CHR in Patois. The STR in English becomes CH or TR in Patois. And the TH in English becomes D. These are special mentions. All right, let's practice. Let's practice some words now. Let's, let's put what we've learned just now into practice. So we have the double A here. And this is father, father, we, barn, daughter, cuss, catch, like, jankro, pardon, protect, jonjo, one, bickle, atm, sus, sidong. Car, that, something, tree, nothing. And this is what the alphabet looks like written. This is a, this is a chart of the Cassidy JLU Patois system. So if you notice, the C is replaced by CH. There is no Q. There is no X. And if you notice the spellings of these letters as well, we have A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, R, S, T, U, V, W, Y, Z. Now, this is an excerpt from the Jamaica New Testament Bible. And like I said, it was written using the Cassidy JLU system that I just explained in this video. So now we're going to read this excerpt from, uh, this is the Lord's Prayer in Jamaican Patois written in the JLU, the Cassidy JLU system. So it says, Jesus show him follow them how for prayer. One day Jesus did the somewhere prayer. After I'm done, one of them special follower them said to him, say, Lord, show we off a prayer. Like how John show fame follower them off a prayer. Jesus tell them, say, When you no prayer, you no fee say, Father, make people have enough respect for you and your name. Make the time come when you rule in a every way. Every day, give we the food what we need. Pardon we for all of the wrong what we do. Can we pardon people we do we wrong too? And now make we face nothing what we cause with a sin. According to the Cassidy JLU system, this is how you would translate and spell the words um, when you write in Patois. Okay, so here are some final notes. The Cassidy JLU system is not yet standardized and the writing system of Jamaica is not yet regulated. Because of this, there is a variation of ways to spell Jamaican words. They are all okay, nobody is right, nobody is wrong. Um, some people still prefer using the older way, which is to spell it like how it's sound using the closest English letters or just writing it in English, reading it in pat with a Patois pronunciation or using a Patois variation. 
Now, the Cassidy GLU system will be used in all of these videos for the most part because it provides some consistency, especially for non-native Jamaican Patwa speakers, and it helps tremendously with pronunciation. So I will be employing this system for the most part in the videos that I will be posting on this channel. All right, so that's it for today. Now, I know that some of these might be a shock, might be shocking to you, and I know that some Jamaicans still have problems reading it because we're still using the the English the English sounds to try to match with the letters. But we need to learn this alphabet by itself for what it is first. Then it will be easier for us to use it as it should be used. But yeah, thanks for um, being here. Thanks for watching and this is yeah this is what it is that takes us to the end of this lesson thank you so much for listening please like share and subscribe and please hit that notification bell so that you may be notified every time when i upload a video i try to upload every other day and sometimes even every day so please hit that notification bell because that would be very helpful also, please follow me on Instagram for daily Jamaican Patois vocabulary. I do build that. Class don't you know. Take care of yourself. Zine.